Hey, this is Brooks with Brooks Marching Drill, and I am going to attempt to show you how I do ripple visuals in Pyware. It's um, it can definitely be tricky, and it can be frustrating and glitchy sometimes. But it's been vastly improved since previous versions, and I hardly ever have problems uh, unless it's my fault. So. We'll just start here. I just quickly put 16 guard members on the field and they're wearing their cool NASA outfits and aviators, but that's a different story. So, uh, 16 guard members and I have this area here. Say they're holding for 24 counts. So, you have to give them time, just like in real life say each move every visual they do is like four counts you have to have at least four counts more than the count of people that are doing it because this person ends on 16 and then they're going to go 16 17 18 19 if that makes sense so you have to give them room to finish so if we have a 24 count hold and 16 members each visual or the visual t in total can be eight counts. So now that I've confused the heck out of you, <laughs> I'm going to go into the timeline, and I'm only going to select the amount of counts that I want to do. For let's say we'll do four count, we'll do a four count visual. I want to deselect everyone except for the person I want to start the visual. This is. I believe the best way to do things to make sure we don't get any errors or glitches or anything. So I'm going to select just that first person that's going to start the ripple. And we've got four counts here. Let's say we want them to do... Let's see how a two count toss looks. I mean four count in a double in two four counts oh my gosh so we got that looks pretty good um, you can do this I don't know if it'll make a difference since we already have it set between two markers but just to be safe double check all good cool and then let's say after that happens We'll go over because we have eight total counts, so they're gonna toss a double, and then we'll do spin quarter beat. So they'll take all four counts to go in one circle. So this is what each person will be doing. Cool. So now we have this one person doing the visual we want in eight total counts. We want to copy this, which I have shortcuts set up on my keyboard, but I'll show you how to do it if you don't. So I have this person here. I have the eight counts I want everyone to end up doing. Edit. Copy. Select this entire area. So we want the visual to span this whole area and then select everyone and then we'll go edit paste visuals and we get a new dialogue so if it's multiple I should probably have done like copy range but I've not played with that but this works so we want to paste copied visuals from the clipboard from 9 to 16 so that's our 8 count visual we do that, and if we don't have it in sequence, they just all do it at the same time. And then we have to wait for them to finish, because they all have to hold. Cool. Now let's say we do want them to do it in sequence, which is a ripple. We want them to go off every one count, so you know, that's pretty common. The only thing it can't do right now is sub counts. 
so we can't do like a subdivided ripple or a site ripple or anything um, and the way I get around that is I just do I split this into two lines so we have pairs going if that makes any sense I don't know you can ask me about that in the comments anyway so we can let's check it out hit play and we got a ripple going but it's not starting with the person I wanted and there's a really easy way to fix that just hit either check or uncheck sequence in reverse order and accept and then we got it so we still have that visual copied and it's in our clipboard so say we had Oh boy. So we had another set of guard right next to them. We can just do the same thing because it's still it's still copied. Go here, edit, paste visuals, and make sure you go to the range and you'll want to test it every time because sometimes it'll reverse the order but this time it didn't so there we go it's pretty easy the the main thing you gotta remember is that the last person is gonna have to have enough counts to finish the visual you've given them so you know 16 performers 8 count visual you're gonna need a 24 count move all together um, they can do this in order too you can do it with lower body upper body horn ups and downs everything so I hope that helps. Um, it's definitely one of my favorite things. And the front people are at attention going into the toss, but I didn't change them to <laughs> be at right shoulder. So, pretty neat stuff. It's something I use a lot, and I, I really like the effect. It helps a lot. So, um, enjoy. Hope this helped. Take care.